y'all. Look at you. Welcome to Wake Up. It's Tuesday, Thursday edition. Thursday edition, y'all. We are so close to the weekend, I can smell it. <sighs> What's that smell? It's the weekend. It's Friday. It's Friday, it's, it's Friday. tomorrow, and after that is Saturday, and after that is Sunday, and that's God's day, and I can smell it. Ooh, yes. Oh, yes. So excited. Love me some Lord on Sunday. I do, I do, I do. Well, listen, y'all, big week. If y'all have been watching the news, yes. you know in Pittsburgh, they've been doing the G20, G20. Summit. Now, yes. for those who don't know, yes. it's where all these financial ministers, ministers. get together mm -hmm. from all these different big, important countries, yes. and they've all got lots of money, yes. and they solve all the world's problems. Yes. And so, Janice. Mm -hmm. I was there yes. because they had asked Mark, my husband Mark, to be a guest speaker there because he has so much money that they just wanted to ask him what he did with it. Yeah. You know? And so I tagged along because when I heard there were financial ministers, I thought, well, Lord, I love that. They're going to talk the about Jesus and money. I know. And there's nothing I like more than Jesus and money. Yeah. So, so excuse me if I have a little private jet lag, y'all. Y'all, it was tough, though, because Iran is a mess. Oh, They're hot a mess. mess. They're a hot mess. They are a hot mess, Getting up there, pounding his shoe. All kinds of yeah, stuff. Well, apparently they don't like us. No. I don't know what we ever did to them. I don't either. I don't either, but they got the, they got the bomb now, apparently. It's very oh, scary. My. Well, I, I just don't feel very safe anymore. I mean, I did, like, I last, what was it, about a year and a half ago with Bush. But I don't know. Not anymore. I wear my rape whistle every day just in case. Just in case. I do, because you don't know. You just don't know. But this is dragging us down. It is. It is. Let's bring it, it up, y'all. I'm okay. so excited to talk about something fun, like, I read that Steven yes. Seagal, did you read about this? Mm, Steven Seagal is going to be a sheriff. Yes. He has gotten himself ordained a sheriff. Don't you feel safer already? I know, I do I feel do. safer. Yes. Actually, I feel a lot better. Because I love those, I love his movies, He would. He could protect us he, from the Oh Iranians. my, he just stabs people. He would, he just stab them. Yeah. He'd stab all of them. There's no discussion. He'd stab everyone in Iran. Oh, wouldn't that be nice if we just over with? I mean, we're going to move it. on. That would be over. Yes. What do we have here? Oh, you know we got one of them fan email segments. Fan email? Yes. Stewart. Stewart. Loves fan email, don't you? I love fan email. Okay. Okay, here, you here read the go. thing, because oh, I don't have me? my bifocal oh. context in. Okay, I can't no see. problem. Here we go. Ready? Dear Janice and Jeffrey. That's us. That's us. You both have the most amazing relationship. We do. That is true. That is true. I am still single. Oh, oh. that's sad. And dying to meet my perfect woman. Oh. How did y'all meet your better halves? Sincerely, Clivis. Cli Clivis? 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 It must be from Clivis. Butte, Montana. Clivis, if it is Clivis, just yes. go by Clivis. Just go by Clivis. That could be the problem. Have you ever been to Montana? I, me? Yes. I went to Idaho. I love oh, Idaho. That? Well, Mark and I actually have a satellite ranch. Up, oh, in, up Montana. in Montana, yes, oh, y'all. Oh, yeah, you do. It's nice. I've it's, seen pictures, y'all. Mm -hmm. They've got over a million head of buffalo. Yes. Oh, it's so nice. We just take the we just take Hudson and Sloan up there, and we just ride our horses it's and so nice. shoot stuff. It's so I fun. love it. Yes, I love that. A it's lot. good. Well, anyway, All right, here we how go. Did, okay. How did you meet Mark? How did you, okay, how did I meet Mark? Y'all know as a first class flight attendant, right, for Texas Air. Well, we met on there because Mark used to fly a lot from Dallas to Vegas because he was th thinking about buying the uh, Caesar's Palace out there until um, Celine Dion came in, and that's a whole other story. He hates Celine Dion, hates but Celine. I love her. Yes. I, um, I so love you, Celine. Oh, he does. So, hey, y'all, the Celine. Uh, hey, y'all. So, I, y'all know make, I make a mean rum and coke. She does. Okay? A mean rum and coke. I have a secret ingredient. I'm not going to tell y'all, but it, it makes it last for hours, y'all, that feeling of numb which is my favorite feeling. Okay, so I brought Mark a rum and coke one day, y'all. And I was sitting there, and I went back to get him some some Texas Sky Mix, y'all. You know that Sky Mix they used to sell Oh, it's Texas so good there? on Texas. It was a mixed jerky bag. Oh, so good, So there was good, like turkey jerky and beef jerky and bison jerky, and every now and then they put ostrich in. Yeah. Yeah, it was good. It was so good, y'all. It, it was Mark's good. favorite, so I was bringing him a package of it, y'all. When I came back, I noticed something in his rum and coke. And I said, Mark Dempsey, is that a tear in your rum and coke? That's what she said. And it was, y'all. He just broke down. <sighs> he just broke down. He was sitting in 3B, and as luck would have it, 3A was open. So, so y'all, that's down. fate. It's fate, y'all. It's fate. Because, y'all, that, that's never open. No, it's that's, never no, open, y'all. No, because it's a window. It's a window. And I sat down, y'all, and I took Mark's head, and I shoved it in my bosom because it's warm. <laughs> and I said to him, talk to me. And he did, y'all. And he told me what was happening with, with him and his ex-wife, Linda. She's a giver. I'm a giver, y'all. And then three months later, 
Uh, Mrs. Dempsey. She's, is that not the most romantic lovely? story? No, she's a taker. No, I'm a taker. That's called yin and yang, y'all. It is, y'all. It's symbiosis. The universe, give them that. Now, right. how'd y'all meet Marjorie? How'd I met Marjorie, y'all. Mm -hmm. Stuart, stop yelling at me. I'm trying. I'm I know, trying. I know. We're, We're short know, on time, so I'm gonna speed it up. So, y'all. So I met Marjorie because when I was in school, you know, I was in interior design school, and I got my major in outdoor furniture. And I was writing my thesis on the use of wicker in warfare, right? And so I would spend a lot of time over at the wicker world. Y'all know wicker world, they're everywhere. Mm, and I would walk around that wicker world, and I'd see all these chairs and, and, and benches and, and beds mm. and stuff that I loved, and, and they would have little numbers in them. Mm -hmm. 114, 182, 201. Every piece I liked, 386. 386. And I said to the guy who ran the place, I said, who's Inspector 386? That's a lot of inspectors. Yes. And he said, no, no, that's not her number. That's her weight. Oh. Well, they started doing that because of the lawsuits they were getting. People oh, yeah. People fall through the wicker People cracks, fall through. So now you know how much weight it can handle. That's 386 right. means it can handle at least 386 pounds. Yes. So I said, I need to meet this person. And so out, so there were these two big double doors at the back of the wicker world, and they push open like this. And out in this scooter came this vision, <laughs> sort of bouncing out. Yes. And it was this beautiful woman who became my bride, mm -hmm. called Marjorie. She weighed 386 pounds. And I said, hi, I'm Jeffrey. And she said, hi, I'm Marjorie. And that's it. That's and how that's we met. Sweet. I know. It's good stuff. That's a good question. That made it my is, heart go pitter-patter. It did, you know, and I just thought of Marjorie's birthday yeah. Oh. I'm going to get her that Yamaha 350 horsepower mode for her scooter. Oh, she'd love it, y'all. You know, she can fly through that wicker world. Fly through the Walmart. Yes. All right, listen, we're going to be back in two minutes, y'all. Get a refill on your coffee, mm -hmm. and we'll see you then. <laughs>